Men frequently judge a woman's attractiveness in the first few minutes of meeting her. They may initially be infatuated with her but subsequently decide she's not worth it or get distracted by someone else. How you treat a woman when you first meet her will shape your relationship. We're helping you get a girl's attention, which isn't hard. Here are 10 ways to make a woman beg for your attention or chase you. Number 10. Make your first impression count. Be confident. Do not fumble. Make sure that anything you say has some depth to it. You can't afford to take the risk of embarrassing yourself in front of her on your first date because if you do, it could very well be the last time you ever see one other. The only thing that could possibly be worse than not having anything to say and the other person feeling fatigued or talking to themselves alone is not having anything to say. This is the only thing that could possibly be worse than not having anything to say. That is not the way you should proceed at all. Get involved in conversations with other people to prevent the storm that's currently raging in your thoughts from getting any worse. Ask questions and show that you are interested in the answer. At the very end, you need to pique her interest to the point that she wants to learn more, and you need to be well informed enough to keep rowing your boat. Number 9. Challenge her subtly. It brings a great deal of satisfaction to people when they are able to meet a challenge and leave a positive impression on others, particularly on someone for whom they have feelings. To be successful in this endeavor, you will need to pose a challenge to her in a manner that is subtle and roundabout. You may state that you are excited about dating someone whose hobbies or pastimes are similar to your own and that you are looking forward to finding that person. She will look at it as a challenge and rise to the situation, which will cause you to consider her as more than simply a friend in the future. Number 8. Don't linger. It is never a good idea to have an excessive number of anything. Believe us when we say that women do not appreciate it when men baby them and follow them all the time. Women find this behavior to be really annoying. Give them the chance to experience the longing that they have for you. Keep a safe distance, but don't get too close. Give people the opportunity to track you down, even if you make it tough for them to do so. To put it another way, you should avoid seeing her as much as possible so that she will miss you even more. Number 7. Show her your mysterious side. Conceive yourself as a riddle for her to solve in order to distinguish yourself from the various other men and women who might compete with you in the future for the role of her companion. We are in no way advocating that you begin conducting yourself in a shady manner, nor are we suggesting that you become elusive and confusing in your conversations. Instead, make an effort to present yourself as something of a puzzle or as someone who cannot be simply comprehended in order to spark her curiosity and keep her wanting to discover more about you. This will keep her wanting to find out more about you. This will excite her curiosity in getting to know you more, and hopefully, in the future, build a loving relationship with you. Number 6. Keep any romantic feelings for her a secret. It is not required that you keep your sentiments a secret from the lady whom you have affection for, nevertheless, if you want her to be the one who pursues you, you will almost certainly need to keep your feelings a secret from her. Do not let her know that you are interested in her on a romantic level, instead, focus on being a good friend to her, spending time with her, and aiding her in any manner that may require your assistance. Avoid making any obvious attempts to flirt with the other person or using any cliché lines. If she finds out that you are infatuated with her, she will think that you are always there for her and may not feel the need to chase you or pursue you if she believes that you are always there for her. If she thinks that you are always there for her, she may not feel the need to chase or pursue you. Number 5. Try to make your hangouts a group affair. Engaging in one-on-one -on -one exchanges with her is a great method to get to know her better and become more familiar with her. However, if you do it too frequently, it may reveal your true intentions as well as the way you feel about her. Try to spend more time with mutual friends in order to give the impression that you are not very interested in her or, at the very least, to demonstrate to her that you do not wish to take the initiative to pursue a romantic relationship with her. This will prevent her from figuring out what you are up to and will force her to compete for your attention. Number 4. Try to be the one who ends a hangout. Someone will invariably be the first person to announce that they need to leave or that they have something else to do at the conclusion of every meeting or hangout. In a perfect world, you would always play the role of that person. 
As long as you make it abundantly clear that you had a fantastic time hanging out with her, there is no need for you to feel bad about telling a lie that you had other things to do. Take a step back for the time being and tell her you'd want to talk more another time. This will pique her interest and make her desire more. Number 3. Make her a little jealous. Jealousy in moderation is good for you. Considering that you are not currently involved in a committed romantic relationship, there are likely many attractive ladies who will want to catch your attention or flirt with you. If you want to make her a little bit jealous or show her that you have people's attention, you might try indulging in some healthy flirting without going overboard with it. It's possible that this will persuade her to show you why she's the right person for you. Number 2. Don't forget to live your own life. When you care about someone, playing games with them or keeping secrets from them might often feel like they are taking up all of your time. When playing mind games, it is quite simple to lose track of who you are or to forget about other things that are important to you. Maintain your concentration and carry on with your life as normal while you try to draw her in closer to you. That means you should continue with your workout routine, concentrate on your work, and continue to hang out with your friends as normal so that she believes you are a busy, interested, and energetic person who does not obsess over her continuously. If she perceives you to be a level-headed and driven individual, she will find it impossible to resist you. Number 1. Be playful with her, but within limits. You can't allow yourself to get totally disconnected from her if you want her to pursue after you. You need to be there for her emotionally whenever she needs you, and you also need to be entertaining to be around. Be someone she enjoys spending time with but keep the significance of those times a secret by seeming as though you get a lot out of spending time with her. Be goofy with her, make her laugh, and tease her, but watch out that you don't step over any boundaries or behave in a manner that is unpleasant or rude. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.